Alright guys, we're back for another Dokkan Battle video and we're continuing the AGL Tapion World Tour. Now, Tapion has been very, very good so far. Uh, we're going into Movie Hero Category Super Battle Road right here. Um, I want to run a double Tapion rotation. Okay, this is going to work out perfect because we'll be able to get the two Tapions together uh, pretty easily here um, by AGL Tapion's second turn. Um, I think the two Tapions potentially could be good enough as a rotation to just like like that's it like boom they're, they're just good enough together to make it work right um all right we will be able to get an 18 key super attack for goku that's beautiful so of course we want to hit turles turles is like the big threat right here um i guess i'll just attack turles as well and then i'm just gonna hit you and we'll go ahead and debuff him as well with tapion's uh, attack lowering so what we're gonna do here again is we're gonna get the two tapions next to each other um, after the Link level update, obviously several of their links, uh, links have had big buffs. So, like, the two of them together, I mean, Brainiacs and Hero, that's 40% defense right there, right? Then they've also got Revival, which is a key link. They're getting a bunch of attack as well. So, the two Tapions next to each other can be very, very solid, right? And that's sort of what we're doing here. Because um, I always found this Movie Hero stage is a little bit tough, uh, just because every... like. It's one of the reasons why Realm of Gods was so hard back in the day. Because, like, every fight, there's, like, four or five enemies. Those uh, designed fights are always really tough. Um, all right, this is perfect. Okay, cool. We'll be able to get all the attacks we need with everyone, it looks like. Yep, okay. So, let's, um... Uh, all right, so he is debuffed. I actually want to hit him again. I'm going to go for a debuff on him, so we'll do that. Um, and then with... Pycon, we can hit you to make sure Pycon doesn't potentially get hit with type disadvantage there. So we'll go ahead and lower his attack a little bit. And then we'll have Gogeta try and finish off Turles. Okay, so let's see how Tur uh, Tapion does. This is without the other Tapion. Duh! Oh, wait, that is Turles just had his attack debuff. Let's see. <laughs> that boy Tapion is something else, huh? Yeah, he's looking pretty good, all right. Man. All right, so with PyCon, they have what? Experienced Fighters and Fierce Battle. They have two attack links together, uh, PyCon and Tapion. Uh, he is impressive. Um, all the difficult content in Tapion is just shut. He's just shutting that shit down everywhere. God Neutral in the God event, like, uh, Tapion is just good. That's really nice. Really nice. Really nice. Really good uh, unit with the attack debuffing, the utility. Um, he He's solid. Uh... Okay, so I did get rid of Turles, so God Goku actually does not have um, his damage reduction active on this turn, because we got rid of Turles, so I do want to keep that in mind. Um, we'll go ahead and potentially take him out, uh, and then Gogeta, ah, that's not good, that Gogeta's going to get hit by Ball Sack Guy, um, but we're just going to let it play out, I guess. We'll, we'll make sure to get rid of him, he's definitely dead. Actually, I'm stupid, Spirit Bomb Goku's definitely going to take him, I could have hit Ball Sack Guy with Gogeta. I definitely could have. And Gogeta could have double supered and finished off Bullsack guy to keep us from getting hit. Yeah, because I mean, if God Goku is doing 75% of one of their health, I'm pretty sure Spear Bomb Goku <laughs> is going to turn this guy to dust. Yeah, uh, a little bit too strong for you to handle, huh? Like, bye. <laughs> okay. All right, so this guy is going to be taken out by Gogeta then. So we're only going to be left with two enemies next turn, so we might not even see... Oh, wow. He nearly took him out with that. Yeah, and then remember that Spirit Bomb Goku, um, when he does his 12 key super attack, he gives himself 50% defense. So additional supers with that Spirit Bomb Goku are very powerful to give him the additional defense and stuff like that. We did get the addition. If I'd hit Ball Sack Guy, we would have killed him. So if we die right here because Ball Sack Guy supers Gogeta, it's a misplay by me. Let me see. Okay, we're fine. All right, cool. Um, and Ball Sack Guy is going to go right there. Okay, well, Icarus Kid Gohan's going to activate, giving us a little bit of extra attack and defense. Um, I guess it doesn't really matter because, I mean, now that we have the two Tapions together, I feel like they're going to really uh, tank well regardless, right? Uh, for this excellent... What? Oh, <laughs> we got PyCon's active skill. He's at 100... Oh, dude. All right, he's at... So, Tapion is at 161k defense. Maybe 15k of that at the most is from Icarus Kid Gohan because it's not glitched anymore. It's just 10% defense. That's very impressive. I have to. Oh, we, <laughs> I, because I could use this. PyCon, we got his active skill, man. There we go. Hello. Oh, man. that was It was close, though. 
Because Ball Sack Guy had to have been above 50% HP for that to happen, and we did get it. Uh, remember that Tech Tapion? What's Tech Tapion's defense here? 97k, but my Tech Tapion is not Link leveled, right? I have to get Tech Tapion Link leveled, for real. Um, Because, like, if, if he's... Tech Tapion could be jumping up to, like, 115k defense or something. His EZA is going to be so good, Tech Tapion. To run both Tapions together, that's going to be really impressive, man. Um, okay, I might not actually even have to use an item on this rotation. I just want to make sure we go into the next rotation above... Um... Okay, I am using an item. We're going to use a Princess Snake and a King Yama. I just want to make sure we take no damage on this rotation at all. So with those two items together, we will do just that. Um, all right, slug attacks the most, huh? I'm gonna just put. I'm just gonna seal this guy to make sure Tech Tapion can't get killed. Um, I actually don't want to do a debuff either, so I'm just gonna smack him. That shouldn't kill him, but it should do some damage. And then we'll hit uh slug, slug. Let's do that right there. Okay. So, again, we're not going to really take damage. Um, I wanted to avoid debuffing, the attack debuffing the enemy so we could see Tapion's, like, true defense against them without the attack debuffs. Uh, but I think the double Tapion rotation is actually good enough to get the job done in here. Just as long as tech Tapion is not going to get hit too much and, like, get super attacked by, for type disadvantage and shit like that, I, I, I do think you could actually run the double Tapion rotation after AGL Tapion gets his EZA and you could beat this stage. So, like, this is a good example of how, like, Super Battle Road stages are super difficult upon release. But, you know, you just get the, these categories to start getting such massive buffs, easy A's and things of the like. And then all of a sudden, it just gets easier and easier and easier um, to take some of these stages down. So, pretty good. Pretty, pretty damn good right there. Okay, so we'll go ahead and, and lay that damage on Slug. That's fine. Uh, we have a lot of damage reduction, so we'll be okay even with that super attack. Surprise, Slug did even that much damage with it. Okay. So now let's see how the Tapions do. Oh, perfect. All right, guess what else I'm going to do? I'm going to go ahead and slap this bad boy with double debuffs to make sure that Tech Tapion can't even take damage with the double because he's got type advantage and we're double debuffing him. Uh, Tapion has everything active except for Giant right here, AGL Tapion. Look at that, 146k. Yep, pretty good. Um, and then I think I'll go for Slug. Um, to potentially try and, and get Slug out of here. Let's see what Tapion takes. Double digits. It's impressive. 2.69 without support. While taking double digit damage, he's got the attack debuff right there. He's really good. That's it. Don't have too much else to say. Oh, nice. We, we got rid of him. Uh, miss, we got rid of Frogger right there. Pretty good. Uh, we also, if we fell below 50% HP... Remember that we could also take the Harutagarn transformation. Harutagarn really isn't that impressive or really that much to write home about. But, I mean, you do have it. It is... So Whoa, Gogeta, you okay there? Oh, I, I guess we're just dead. Oh, okay. Thank you, Gogeta. <laughs> not just dying, I guess. <laughs> Thanks, Gogeta. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> okay. I guess Slug... I didn't debuff Slug, right? So, yeah, that's... Sheesh. Gogeta, relax, brother. Oh, my goodness. All right. Um, right. I'm just going to attack. Uh, What am I doing here? Okay. I'm going to go for you to make sure you cannot do that. Uh, I'm going to use the Princess Sink right here as well. Just to make sure we go into the next rotation at full health. Let's go ahead and get rid of Slug. And then I'm also going to have PyCon attack Slug and hopefully take him down. All right, pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, Movie Heroes, man. The non-stop buffs we've gotten for the last couple months. Move, both Movie Heroes and Movie Bosses are making up significant ground. Because I think both of those teams before, it's like they had some really impressive units on them. But, like, you know, like they needed more characters to, to buff up their roster. And I think both teams are actually really starting to come together very, very nicely. Spirit Bomb Goku has looked insane in this video, by the way. <laughs> Hasn't he? Like, oh my god, is he still so good? Like, damn, did they make a beast. What, like, whew. He's, he's strong. That's Spirit Bomb Goku, man. He does not play around. He is very good. 
And when he doubles supers, he does everything. Because this D after again, after a 12 key super attack, Spirit Bomb Goku's defense is really good. So, like, when he doubles suit, you get the 18 key followed by him 12 key. Like, that's just so impressive. Okay. So, again, here's the combo that we're going to do to help Tactapion out. I'm going to hit Gokua with double debuffs right there. Now, I'm pretty sure blue Gogeta is probably going to get us killed. But um, we'll see. We'll see what happens. All right. All right. Let's see how AGL Tapion does. But we already know the answer. He takes no damage. He completely just tanks everything. Completely good. Sorry. Can't touch me. And he's doing pretty reasonable damage. I mean, obviously, we have, like, every link of his active. Oh, he's just going to one-shot Gokua himself, actually. Sorry, Gokua. You're out of here. Goodbye. <laughs> actually, he's just going to pull his dick out and just cock-slap Gokua. <laughs> 92K? <laughs> nice try, buddy boy. Oh, no! The double debuff, Bojack. Say it ain't so! <laughs> okay. Yeah, that, that turned out pretty well. Um, the Tapion rotation, man. Wow. I mean, what's going to happen when Tech Tapion gets his EZA? It might, it's not going to be for a long time because Tech Tapion is going to be a sub EZA. But, like, you know, we still need sub EZAs from 2019 EZAs, right? Like uh, Physical Sin Shenron, um, the, the Tech and Int Base Vegitos, right? Like, they're, we're still waiting on them. So it's going to be a long time, potentially, until we see Tech Tapion's EZA. But um, he's pretty good. Uh, again, I, I, I'm pretty impressed, man, with Tapion. Full day of content. And Tapion has exceeded my expectations, like, the entire way through. Um, he's good in Super AGL Extreme Super Battle Road, which a lot of players still struggle with. An additional option there is not a bad thing. Again, movie heroes and movie bosses both could use the option. This guy real like... Um, the two Tapions together, like Sibling Bond is probably, Sibling Bond is probably going to be one of the next stages to get a Super Battle Road stage, right? One of the next category stages to get one. Uh, and like the, running the Tapion rotation on there will definitely work. Uh, I'm impressed. I, I really like what they did with the CGL Tapion. Let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching and I'll catch y'all next time.